All right, so first thing we're going to do is head over to the left side. We're going to grab the SVD sniper rifle first. You'll find it inside this little storage area here. If you use the cardboard box, you can, you can actually go up stairs and slopes faster, which I will do in just a second here. So I'm going to switch to the cardboard box for that purpose. Because you'll notice that Snake goes slower when he runs up slopes, like little hills or stairs, he gets a little bit slower from that. Um, but you can use the cardboard box and he'll just be at normal speed. So right now, we're just heading to where the end is because he's always in the same location. I plan on making a 100% walkthrough for this game soon. I'm actually replaying it right now just to familiarize myself with the game again. So. I just want to get used to everything first before I start making a 100% walkthrough, obviously. Alright, so switch to the stun grenade and the enemy won't be able to hear you with the stun grenade out. As long or any grenade out as long as you have it pulled out when you get up to the end crouch and use the sig and then freeze them into place now we're gonna try and get his camel so just keep going up and down with your gun towards his head eventually he'll wiggle all the camo I don't think so I don't think so now you want to shoot his head three times for the gun two Three. This gets you the Mosin Negant um, after the boss fight. As long as you shoot his head three times. Uh, here I kind of fucked up. I was gonna spray him again, but I. But going for the camo and it slowed me down a little bit, and I got all fucked up. Plus, I bumped into that tree as well, <laughs> which I never usually do. But anyways, it doesn't matter because you don't want to get the end too low on stamina. Like right now, he's perfect where, where he is right now. Because if you get him too low, he's he's gonna be on the left side, and he's actually like almost impossible to get on that side. So this side's the best side that you want to end on is the right side. So now we're just gonna stun lock him. So spray with the sig, switch to a pistol to put him down, freeze him down into place. Then we switch to sig. Wait for him to get down just a little bit. Spray him again. This time we wanna switch to a sun grenade. Stun immediately. Look up to the sky. And delay your sig spray a little bit. And then switch to sun grenade and stun him immediately. Look up. And then once you switch to the sig again, you want to delay it. And then switch back to the stun grenade and stun immediately. So the sig is always delayed. You want to delay the sig spray because if you go too fast, instead of stun locking the end, you'll end up just making him run away. So you don't want to go too fast. Alright, so here's the moss camo. Now after the boss fight, we just come right down here, and there's the Moles in the Gant. I don't know how to pronounce it. But anyways, that's his gun that we got for getting the three headshots. And you obviously seen the cam already, so. Alright, thanks for watching.